prepositions with verbs. We have seen that when using preposition with pronouns or nouns, the form of pronoun or noun changes, which is called Samanya Rup in Marathi or oblique case or oblique form in English. Same way happens while using preposition with verb. For example, in English we say after doing, before singing, while writing. In English we use ing form of verb for preposition usage. In Marathi, nya is suffix to verb. So let's see. Verb in English do, verb in Marathi is kar, and samanya rup of verb is karanya. Speak, bol, bolanya. Dance, nach, nachanya. So about speaking, bolanya badal. For eating, khanya sati. Special behavior for preposition after. Preposition after can be used two ways. Consider two sentences. She spoke after my dancing. Another way. She spoke after I danced. The first sentence can be formed by a borul. After dancing. Nachanya nantar. She spoke after my dancing. Majha nachanya nantar. Ti gayali. In second sentence, we use after I danced. I danced in Marathi is me nachalo. So in such cases, we suffix lya instead of anya. So after dance becomes nachalya nantar. Full sentence will be she spoke after I danced. Me nachalya nantar ti bolali. He cried after she went. Ti gelya nantar to radala. Special behavior for preposition while. Suffix for while is tana. While can be used in two ways. Do not stop while I speak. We can also say do not stop while I am speaking. In first sentence, the verb is simple present tense. In such cases, the suffix is tana. Examples, while I speak or while speak, bola tana, while do, kara tana, while dance, nacha tana. In second sentence, the verb is present continuous tense. I am speaking in Marathi is me bolat asto. Note that refer the section of sentences with used to for these kind of uh, sentences for form asto. So suffix tana gets added to asuto and becomes asatana. So in short for a second style the verb will be as shown below while speaking bolat asatana. While doing, karat asatana. While dancing, nachat asatana. Special behavior for preposition to. Suppose we are telling someone, come to see this movie. Come to drink coffee. Here we use to see, to drink. We did not use seeing, drinking, etc. Similarly, in Marathi, we use different form for preposition to. We append ayala to verb. Examples to see, baghayala. To do, karayala. To speak, bolayala. To dance, nachayala. Come to see this photo. Photo, baghayala, ye. Come to eat with me. Majha barobar, jevayala, ye. Special behavior for and. In English, we use preposition and to join two verbs to indicate one action is followed by other. For example, come and see this. Sit and eat it. In Marathi, we will suffix un 
to first verb to indicate continuation for example sit and watch basun bag come and go yeun ja he came and saw it tyane yeun bagitale they will go and check it te jaun tapasatil smile and say hasun bol thank you